Customer data gives you a better understanding of customer demographics, what customers want and how they behave. We are the CRM Lab and we are your source of CRM content, tips and strategies. And today we are looking at how to manage customer data in CRM, how it's structured and how to get the most out of it. The way we see it, CRM does three things for your business. It organizes, it automates, and it helps your business to grow. Now, automation and growth would not work without an organized database at their foundation. Data organization is the cornerstone for any successful business for a number of reasons. Reliable reporting and analytics, fewer open tabs, data regulations at year two, and personalized outreach to leads and customers. All in all, data organization matters because it forms the foundation for sales activities. But how does CRM software get all your data organized no matter how much there is? Well, it's all about structure. Let's take a look at the most significant component of your CRM system, the workspace. From there, we'll drill down to folders, subfolders, records, and finally, fields. So, what is a CRM workspace? It's the first thing you log into in the morning. It's your dashboard, your hub, or whatever else you want to call it. In the CRM workspace, you can change who can edit and access your data. It's the foundation upon which your CRM data is built. It's also where your folders live. And that's what we're going to look at next. CRM folders represent a single business process, such as contact database, tech support tickets, pipelines, and all the good stuff. In NetHunt CRM, we have three default folders ready to be edited, refined, and made unique to your business. Those folders are called contacts, deals, and companies. The contact folder is home to prospects, leads, and clients your company has engaged is engaging or will engage. Each individual has a record in the contact folder and all those records are linked to the same separate company folder. The contact folder contains simple data fields such as first name, last name, job title, email address, telephone number, company, website, location and social media links. The deal folder stores all the data that's related to individual deals. You might conduct multiple deals with the same company or individual through cross-selling or upselling. The deals folder keeps those transactions separate. The deal folder contains a different data set such as primary point of contact, deal stage, managing rep, deal volume, probability of closing the deal, expected close date, and the company that the deal relates to. The company folder holds all your company records in the workspace. This is useful because during a B2B sales deal, a sales team might communicate with any number of employees. Conversations get scattered across different dashboards and contact records. The company folder organizes and visualizes data fields such as the name, stages, lead source, its size, industry, their dedicated rep, as well as contact and social media details. From folders, we can create subfolders. In NetHand CRM, subfolders are filtered, sorted views of different aspects of data. A common method for our users to take advantage of NetHand's views is to build different sales pipelines. But subfolders are flexible and can be used however you like. For example, you can track leads created this week with a breakdown of sources, or users who subscribe to your newsletter, or users in trial period, or in active deals, or even leads that are going to close this month. Each subfolder or folder comprises several individual records. So what's a record? Records are like profiles of all the companies, contacts, and deals in your CRM database. Correct field management starts a domino effect for correct business, data, and team management. Full fields make good records. Good records make your folders effective. When your folders are effective, your workspace works. 
And when your workspace works, your whole team is on track, aiming for the same goals with a structured sales process. So, what fields are essential for correct field management? First name, last name, job title, email address, contact type, phone number, company name, location, birthday, and website. Fields are the most fundamental form of data in this guide. They keep one single data point in your CRM system. That's why when choosing a CRM solution, it's important to choose one that doesn't limit the types of data your business can store. NetHunt CRM offers a delectable menu of CRM fields where your data can make itself at home. Basic text and number fields, sure, but we've also got a bunch of contact details for different social platforms, check boxes, drop downs, statistic fields, and even formula fields. CRM Lab is the number one source of CRM tips, content, and strategies on the internet. Subscribe to our channel for more. And if you're an early stage startup looking to get on top of your CRM data, look no further than NetHunt CRM. Hit the link in the description where you can apply for the early stage startup plan, free for three months and cheap after that. Stay tuned because the next video is on how to set up drip campaigns on CRM. Organize, automate, grow.